Hey YouTube, this is Everything Epan here, and today I'm doing a video tutorial on how to install Remix OS in VirtualBox or VMware. Now, what Remix OS is is basically a operating system that really looks like Android, and it's basically for PC. Now, this operating system was highly requested by multiple different people, so I needed to get this one out. So I'm going to do this one for you guys, and um, I will include the uh, links in the description for VirtualBox VMware and um, Remix OS. Um, this will be the site that you will get to when you um, click the link in the description. You'll get two options either for 64-bit or 32-bit. You can choose either one and then here are the recommended system requirements of a 2 gigahertz dual core processor or better. Recommended of 2 gigabytes of system memory, a minimum of 8 gigabytes of free hard drive space and internet access is helpful. So. There you go guys, that's the uh, download links and the uh, recommended uh, system requirements. So now we're going to actually do the installation process. And I'm going to use VMware for this because well, I tried it with VirtualBox and it didn't really work. So I'm going to try it with VMware. Well, I did try it with VMware and it worked, but VirtualBox didn't work at all. So I will do VMware this time. So VirtualBox users, if you have any questions about this, you might be out of luck. I'll try and help you as best as I can, but for now, um, we'll just do VMware. So what you want to do is create a new virtual machine and browse for your ISO. Mine was already there, but it should say like Remix OS for PC, 64-bit or 32-bit. I did the 64-bit, and it'll say free BSD, free BSD detected. Go ahead and hit Next, and then you can rename this to Remix OS. As I did there and hit next and then I'm going to store this as a single file and leave it at 20 gigs even though the minimum is 8 and then for here you want to customize and make sure you bump up your RAM I'm going to bump mine up to 4 gigs the recommended is 2 gigs but I now have 16 gigs of memory used to have 8 but I got um, 8 more gigs of memory to get 16 gigs and I also got a new graphics card the EVGA uh, GeForce GTX 950 um, for some PC games, so a little bit of upgrading to my computer, but now 16 gigs of RAM. I'm going to do 4 gigs, hit close, and then finish, and it's going to power on. And then when it boots up, hit the arrow keys to stop the uh, countdown here. And then there's two options here. There's a resident mode, and there's a guest mode. Resident mode basically means is you're actually installing this operating system on the machine, or even on actual hardware, if you want. Guest mode is basically you can do uh, run this live and it doesn't save anything and you can do this as many times as you want so I tried resident mode on both VirtualBox and VMware VirtualBox didn't work at all VMware it just kept loading and it would not load the operating system setup at all um, guest mode didn't work on VirtualBox for me but worked on VMware it just takes a while to load so you go down to get I'll just do guest mode you can try resident mode if you want but I'll just I can just recommend doing guest mode that way you don't actually have to install it. So go down to guest mode and hit enter. And it'll say booting the curl and it'll load all this stuff up. And it'll say Android on the bottom. And then um, after a little bit, it will give you the uh, Remix OS logo. After it loads up for a little bit here. And so there you go, there's the uh, Remix OS logo here. And this will um, load up for a while, so you just have to uh, let this run for a little bit. It'll flash for a while, and then the operating system should pop up with a little bit of setup instructions. So just let that sit for a little bit, and I'll be back with you guys once we hit the um, operating system setup screens. Okay, so after a bit it'll say welcome to Remix OS and then it'll get you to the uh, language part of the setup here. So this is actually really, really glitchy right now because earlier it actually was not glitching like this, but um, hopefully you guys will have a smoother screen. Just try and follow along as best as you can. So what we're going to do is select our language and mine is English. Just click on that and agree the user agreement. It may be because I'm dedicated more than enough RAM to it or it's because I'm recording I'm not really sure but it's whenever I move my mouse so then it'll do the Wi-Fi setup you should be able to connect to the internet without doing this Wi-Fi setup to so just go up to uh, 
skip and then it'll say discover and install great apps and then what you want to do is go down to continue when that comes up and then you can install apps if you want I mean it's a computer so I doubt you'll need any of these so I'm going to uncheck this go down to it's really hard to do this my bad go down to hit next and then just do the same thing you can it'll confirm of which ones you want to install so I'm going to uncheck this and I'm not going to show this message again and then I'm going to hit yes I really apologize for the amount of flickering on the screen it's really bothering me too and then once you're done just hit finish and then hit next you can activate it if you want I'm just gonna do it no matter what it will say setup complete and then it will load up the uh, desktop of remix OS and you'll see that it looks kinda similar to Android here and I won't move the mouse just so you can see the desktop but um, there you go that's uh... it's got the back button the home button it's got some uh, the time and stuff on the bottom and it's got some uh, icons on the desktop so it's gonna flash again but i'm gonna go to uh... the what it's called the start menu and i'm gonna open up google chrome and show you that i'm connected to the internet and i can access websites this is their home website and I'll even go to I really do apologize about the screen flashing by the way go to youtube.com and it loads up right away so there you go guys I'm connected to the internet and everything so there you go guys that's how to install remix OS in VirtualBox or VMware um, thank you guys for watching. Um, VirtualBox users, if you have questions, I can try and help as best I can, but you might be uh, screwed for right now, but I'll try as best I can to help you guys out, but VirtualBox users might be uh, screwed, but VMware users, you can ask me questions and I'll try and help you as well. But um, Once again, uh, thanks for watching. Um, like this video if you enjoyed, and also if you want to see more videos like this, um, also don't forget to share the video and leave comments down below of ideas of what I should do next like what operating system I should do next or any other video ideas and stuff like that and don't forget to subscribe for more videos once again thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video